Today in this Pop Rock FL Studio tutorial, I will be remaking She's All I Want to Be by Tate McRae. You want to start with a tempo around 150 to 160 BPM, get some nice piano chords. As you heard, the volume is a little on the low side. For the preset that I used, I used a closed grand light preset from the piano pack that was free and flex. Next are the guitar chords. These are the same exact chords from the piano, just with a guitar sound. I used two presets from flex, the free guitar pack, uh, this preset, and then this one as well. It doesn't need to sound like a real guitar at all, it just needs that like texture or that sort of sound in order to fill up the mix a little bit. For the mixing for both the piano and the guitar, I have a EQ that gets out a good chunk of the lows and a side chain for every bar and 65% on the mix. I also have a guitar from the original song that adds a little flavor to the guitar sound. If you're making your own original song, you're obviously going to want a guitar sample or play the guitar yourself. <laughs> Next, I have a pad with the same chords from earlier. To accomplish the sound, I used a vital preset from mhamusic.com, basically just to add some ambience. For the bass, I just used the bass notes from the chords from earlier, nothing too complicated. I used three presets to accomplish this. I used a bass preset from the Flex Essential Bass Guitars pack, again from the free section, another one, <laughs> and another preset from MHA's Vital Sample pack. Now for the drums, I used a loop from Splice. A little on the quieter side just to fill up the drums a little bit, and then I have a loop that I chopped up in order to fit the pattern of the song and basically what you want to do is just find a kick find a snare and then make it into a pattern that's sort of something like this doesn't have to be exact but like a something like that and then I have a crash as well and now for the vocals. I did something a little bit different for the vocals. I didn't really keep the vocals the same. I added some parts of the vocals where it's lower in pitch and then higher in pitch. So for example, this right here. Something like that. And after all that, here is the final result. Stupid boy, you can be so sad. 